What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back on AFK Arena and it is time to finish up being first in Arena of Heroes. So I am excited about this. I am going to end up being first in server 206, I think, or my ladder of Arena of Heroes here. Super excited about that. Uh, some of my biggest challengers here, for the longest time, Super Ugly was the guy right behind me. There's his team right there. Um, he changed it up a little bit once I passed him. He was uh, four um, Graveborn. Uh, he had Nara, or no, he had Grezel and... Do you have Grezel, Brutus in the front? Then he had Nara, Culther, and um, uh, do you have? I think he had Sylvina in the back, um, and so he was he uh, he gave me troubles for a long time. Uh, this guy just recently got up here at the top. Uh, we'll fight both of them. Uh, they were this guy. He was in like fourth or fifth most of the time, not in second, but he but he pushed his way up to second. Got a pretty decent team there. Uh, the two people that gave me trouble on my way to the top was this guy, uh, Gatsu Enkvar, and um, uh, Necromancer. I mean, obviously my team is way better than most of these people, so it didn't give me that big of a problem, but it gave me a fair amount of issues, but... Yeah, we're going to do my dailies for this and check it out. So first we have uh, Simon's team here. So you can see I have better heroes. This is not the team that I usually used. So we're going to use the team that I usually used. I'll use my main team in a video coming up very soon. But for the purposes of this, this is the team that I did most of this with. Either Laika here or I did have Lucius at the beginning um, but either Laika or Athalia, those were kind of the combos that I used. Either Laika or Athalia. I know I, I'm not getting any boosts, and that's why I had some troubles against some of the guys. But um, yeah, let's hop into this and check this out. So pretty much Shamira tanking is all that it takes for me to do pretty much any of the to win any of this. I mean, Shamira just absolutely destroys, um, especially with her being ascended. She wasn't ascended for the longest time, so I did have a little bit tougher times with the arena when she wasn't ascended. But, you know, once I got her ascended, it was kind of a GG, a kind of a big GG. So let's go ahead and challenge Super Ugly. Uh, his Nara gave me some decent problems early and that's kind of the big reason that I wanted Nara uh, was the first day of this um, I faced off against him and his Nara just absolutely destroyed me it was kind of crazy uh, was not expecting it at all and she just absolutely plowed through my soul and it was it was kind of crazy because she was she, she was I didn't understand how her ability worked at the very beginning that she grabs whoever's directly across from her so I never, so I was struggling with that for a little bit, and his team was all Graveborns and one um, Brutus, and so it was kind of difficult at the beginning to handle. Um, let's go ahead and let's challenge Prophet. There are some weaker people in this that I get offered to battle, and so why not? We'll slaughter them real quick. I'll also show you guys the challengers. Uh, I'm kind of at the peak of where I can get to in that, but I'll still show it. I, I don't think I can win. I have like two tickets for that, but I, I don't think I can really do anything for that uh, because the teams are all better than mine that it wants me to fight. And so there's, there's not a whole lot I can do when the teams are just like ridiculously crazily better than I am. I mean... I wish I could progress in it farther, but there's no way really for me to get the first without spending a bunch more money, and I just am not doing that. Uh, so we're almost done with this. I have been skipping through most of the days because, like, I know I'm going to win, and so I don't feel the biggest of needs to watch all of these. I'm doing it for the video because, uh, why not? But, um there's no way any of these guys are actually going to beat me, so I just pretty much have been skipping through. That might be our last one. 
I started saving my extra ones as you can see I've got two saved up for the next one I don't know what I don't know how the arena of heroes is exactly lank or done I don't know if it's put in by tiers of your level or if it's server based or what this is going to be um, I, I think it would be fun if it wasn't scaled like so if I go to the next one I think it would be fun to compete against the same guys week after week I think that would be a lot more fun. So we did we did get that box. What are we going to get out of that? Uh, pit gift surprise. Oh, let's go. Let's go. That is beautiful. I needed that badly. I need so much of the of the hero essence. It's ridiculous. I need so much of that. So any hero essence that I can get, I am thankful for. Okay, so the Legends Challenge Tournament. I got some to collect here. I got 3,000 coins to collect. But uh, this is kind of the formations that I've been running. Uh, they have a little bit more synergy. They're not... None of these are my main team. But they provide some synergy. The top, I obviously get the five light bearers. Because Athalia counts as anything you put her with. So five light bearers. It has Fox, so it takes someone off the map. Um, in the second one, we have the four Graveborns and Brutus. Because Brutus is such a beast and I have a Mythic Plus, I kind of have to use him. I feel obligated to use him. And so he, uh, he's part of the Graveborn team, essentially. He's just part of the Graveborn team. And then we have a Wilders team, just because somehow I ended up with Wilders at level 140. Um, and the Succubus is there with them. But I'm in 7th, as you can see. I can't beat these guys above me. They're just too much better than me. Fishdix is the guy that I have to, like, attack. But you can see clearly I'm not beating his teams. The positive is he doesn't have a whole lot of synergy going on in the final team. So it's a possible team that I could beat. But it's still, like, better than my team. It's got a level 160 Brutus to make up for it not being synergized. And it's hard because I can't really take away my Shamira. To put her on a crappy team because none of the teams are really crappy so it kind of just makes it difficult you can see there's just I, I can't beat anybody i can beat the guys below me like this guy obviously i can beat him but i can't i can't beat the guys above me uh let's see here let's get it with a refresh yeah see it just gives me the top guys that i clearly can't beat like oh yeah let me challenge this guy I'm, i def i definitely can beat him but I, I, it's just kind of, I like the Legends Challenger tournament, but if you're going to make me fight guys that are all above me, I mean, I can't beat any of these guys. They're just way too, they're way too good for me. I, I mean, we can try fish sticks here. I'll show you. I just can't, I can't beat them. It just, it just doesn't work. I'm actually going to switch those. Yeah, I'm going to do it like that. But it, it just sucks. I just can't. I can't actually beat him. Because, like, if I put it there, I'm at a disadvantage already before the fight even starts. Uh, because it would be the same unit on unit, and I'm just not better than that. Um, Nara, Shamira. That's fine. Nara can grab my Shamira. I'm winning this because I have Shamira and Nara. They're my two best characters. And Tazi. Actually, this isn't set up exactly the way... That team is set up the way I expected, but... I guess Tazi's a part of this team instead of this team? Yeah, but Athali is part of that team, so they get the boost anyway. Um, and then this team gets the four stack boost because it's got Kalther in it. And then this team gets the four starred boost. See, the issue is I can't beat that final team. I don't think. I don't think it's possible. I just don't think it's, it's not possible. I can't beat that Brutus. So I feel like I can construct... What are Wilders? Wilders are weak against Maulers. So I feel like I could switch these two teams around and maybe have a shot at this. We're only going to give this one go. I'm not going to like spend a bunch of time on this. Uh, let's do this. And then I got to try to protect my Belinda. And then... I guess the Light Bearers are strong against the Maulers, so I don't know. Maybe in some fantasy universe this will work out for me. I don't know why I did that like that. I need my Light Bearers in here, so I need... I need Fox and Estrilda. I want Fox there. And no, let me get the healer off the map. Uh, do I want the heal? Yeah, give me, give me the healer off the map. Let me do that. And then... 
That's good. And then down here, Athalia, bang, bang, and bang. Okay. So let's try this. One try. I don't think I can beat this. I just don't think it's possible. I have to win the first one there, and you can see it just didn't work out. I, that just didn't work out at all. That was just an absolute wreckage to start off with. I'll easily win the second one, but it doesn't matter. You have to win two out of three, and I'm not doing it. Uh, Brutus isn't going to pull off the greatest clutch in the history of the world. Like, I absolutely dominate with the second squad here. But the issue is just I don't have enough to to, to get it done on the, the rest of them, which just sucks. The teams are decent. They're not terrible teams. They just aren't good. I've started gearing my characters, some of my other characters, just to give it a chance, maybe. Give me a chance to fight in this a little bit better. But, yeah, you can see I'm just not quite good enough. I easily sweep the second, but I just get swept in the first and, and third. Um, so that's kind of why I, have, I haven't been doing that a whole lot. Um, but you can see I've started to gear all of my characters. So there's like that gear and there and there. I've kind of sacrificed leveling up like the Brutus gear right there. But you can see that I've started gearing all of my characters that I'm going to be using in the Legends Challengers thing. Um, I still have a lot of gearing to do for them, but they're at least geared, which helps them out a fair amount. Um... Next step is to get them all the, like, legendary, I guess, so that they're a little bit better. Also, I should probably ascend Brutus here, because if I ascend Brutus, uh, it'll bring all of them, obviously, and then I can start leveling them up past 140. Brutus is just kind of stuck there. Um, when the when the shop rolls over, I do have 20, to or 20 summon scrolls for factions that I've gotten from completing campaign missions. And so when that happens, I only need one more Baden. If I get one more Baden, I can make him Mythic. And then if I really want to, I can make him Mythic Plus. Um, it'll depend on what I pull. But even if I get him to Mythic, I'll probably go ahead and reset Brutus and use um, Baden here. Uh, Baden, one of my favorite characters, but he's a little too squishy right now. I need to get him better. I need to get him up, and, and I think he could be a lot better. I actually have the health recovery rate on him right now. Um, I should probably have that on someone else, but he has it for now. Not that that's a, not that it's a big deal. I should probably have it on Tazi or Brutus. Probably have it on Brutus, even though I don't use Brutus that much. Or I don't think I should have it on Belinda, but it doesn't really matter. But that's going to do it for this video, guys. We went ahead and finished first in Arena. I'm super excited about that. I know it's not worth a whole lot. It's going to get me 800 gems, and it's going to give me 880 gems. It got me 80 gems a day, which was nice, but um, super happy about finishing in first. Uh, kind of my first real accomplishment of some sort in this game, I guess. Uh, keep an eye out in the next episode of this that we have. I will be going through Chapter 14, seeing how far we can make it with our current team. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you have not, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!